Gang, what's good? Gang, what's good? We about to react to Ray Jene Carter. She about to sh shock supporters with a new boo, I guess. And I don't, I don't know why people keep putting her and her and our mind together. Like, they been broke up, let folks live their life. People break up all the time. Like, sometimes things don't work. Like, leave them two alone. But before we get to this video, like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, man. Ring the bell so you stay notified. Share the video as well. Share with your mama, your cousin, your daddy, your auntie, your grandpa. Share the video. I'm applying pressure and dropping bangers. Now, let's get into it. That Regine may have a new boo. Now, Regine and New Boo were apparently out in Aspen together. That trip that Regine posted on her YouTube, she didn't really state who she, she was out there D &D? with. People were assuming that maybe Armand went with her, but no, it appears that she has a new man. So people have been comparing the two backgrounds, even comparing one of Regine's photos, as you can see in her glasses, the person that's taking the picture has the same outfit on as the alleged Supporters are nosy, boo. bro. So you guys leave your opinions on that. They put that two and two together just from looking into her glasses. Like, So fuck? she stepped out of dating men in the music industry. But let's move on to this next topic with Carmen and Corey. Now, when Carmen posted her recent video with Michi, people already knew at that point it was about to cause some trouble with Corey. Even in her comment section, someone states, it's OMG, please don't get Corey started on BS. We ain't never gonna hear the end of it. Carmen just responded with, crying face emojis because i'm assuming she knew that corey was about to pop back off with something because mm -hmm. they because they together did. now yesterday corey posted a video on his youtube of him vlogging with carmen and the boys stating that he took his family on a cabin trip now here's my thing corey has the camera out he's recording Carmen sees him recording. She's not telling him not to record. That part. So she knew what was coming after she posted that video. So it appears that Carmen is not trying to hide that she's out with Corey. So then Corey started posting photos of her in that new car that he just bought. Stayed in what? sleep in a jailbreak. Red eye gonna wake you up. Then he was defending her when Zoe was talking about them on Instagram Live. He says, at Carmen, I got your back. He left in the comments, you gonna stop playing with Carmen. Now, people in the comment section of Corey's video were mm -hmm. assuming that that video was old, but I'm thinking that video had to be about two weeks to a week ago because people also noticed that the same food that was in the refrigerator when Corey did that video move back to yeah. Alabama. I'm telling you, supporters are smart, man. Like, the supporters that be watching these YouTubers, man, them niggas is like really FBI agents. Like, that's that same banquet chicken. That's that same pepperoni pizza in his freezer. Like, people being too too close to detail to these YouTuber shit, man. Like, what the hell? Was the like, that's the same in the main juice in there. refrigerator, he stated, staying in a cabin with my family. So this is as a... Re why, uh, why does this... Why did they have... Croissants? Why do they have... Why did they have fucking Jimmy Dean... Shit that's supposed to be in the freezer, in the fucking refrigerator, y'all. Excuse my language, but why is those Jimmy Dean croissants in the regular refrigerator when they when they can't when they when you get them they in the frozen section in the store? What in the hell? Recent, I'm thinking Corey may have recorded this video about a week or two ago. So Carmen has been with uh -huh. Corey, and she's not trying to hide it. But as Carmen has stated previously, she is just trying to co-parent. Co-parenting and, and staying in a cabin with your, kids. And with your baby daddy is two different things. I just things. believe Carmen is having a hard time trying to figure this whole co-parenting mm -hmm. thing out. She doesn't know where to set boundaries, and I believe Corey is taking advantage yeah, of that. That's the same thing I think. Carmen does seem and appear to really like Michi, but every time they get in a good spot, Corey comes back. See, and I think the thing is, Carmen doesn't know what to do. She don't know if she should stay with her husband. She don't know if she should try it with Michi. And then Corey maybe do something that make her think she's changing, even though he's not changing. 
people he probably changed into an extent until he get her back and then he gonna be the same Corey. Like don't and in my opinion in in my opinion, the only reason why Corey wants Carmen back is for views. Like his his channel do way better when with Carmen on her because people mess with Carmen as you can see. The girl started a whole new YouTube channel after he took her shit, and she got to two hundred k in two weeks and was getting mad views. He seen that so he he don't. Corey don't want her back just because he actually wants him. That that's what I think. He just wanted for the money. The internet now you have people coming back at her like, what is going and on? And he just wanted her back to Corey show people like, I can disrespect this girl. I can do her dirty, and she's still gonna take me back. Like he just he that's he wants that power over. Oh, and he got it. Shit. Oh dang. Dang. That man said, F you, ain't that stupid? Not the kids, but the mom and the dad. That man, Zoe. So after Corey so posted that video, on, Carmen like, then I'm went on to on. Twitter and stated, so many deaths keep have been me, going on lately, all, and, and that's people be me, worried about the wrong thing. I'm drained, and I'm not going to let one situation to keep draining me. God sees it all, and that's all that matters to keep Yes, indeed. Like I stated, and Carmen explained that she is trying to co-parent with Corey, but honestly, I feel like she just doesn't know where to set those boundaries again, and Corey is taking advantage mm -hmm. of that. Now, Corey did go onto his Instagram, and he posted, everyone go spam Carmen and tell her God loves her, hope everything is okay pray for her so then the shade room teens posted Corey's post and carmen's mind. response on twitter then what? Corey wrote underneath i changed that post, my mind her. i changed my mind her n-word gonna get zoe lol so then carmen oh, goes on to post yeah, a up. daily prayer she says hey god every day i get up i'm trying to do better than yesterday i don't always get it right i've made some mistakes sometimes my mouth is faster and i'll keep walking to the places that we talk about are louder than my faith but you know my heart i'm not where i want to be but i'm also not where i used to be help me manage the in between and i'll keep walking to the places that we talk about so now again Carmen is really going through it right now because her friend died like and all kinds of trying to figure this whole co-parenting thing out. Again, she's not trying to hide anything from anyone because Corey was recording and she didn't tell him to nah, stop recording. Care. So she knew that he was going to post this. I'm guessing she didn't know how people were going to take it. Like, oh, they're back together type thing. When Carmen is just... Carmen like, look, I'm solo and dolo. That man putting us together. ...and personalized care from the national leader in chiropractic. He thinking he got his family back. I ain't even said a word. Just looking at it like, no, I'm just trying to co-parent. But anyways, you guys leave your opinions on that down in the comment section below. Corey is just making this whole situation harder mm -hmm. for her and to promote everything that he has going on because now all eyes are on him and Carmen. He wants that because he just dropped his leave album your too. Opinions on that and everything Our else EP, in whatever this it's video. Called down in the comment section below it's not playing with me mm. hey so i doing a boogie before the show that's all no no i'm so serious yeah corey is always talking to zoe all right so take this out so i'm coming to tell you tomorrow to get that spray i need it but i ain't gonna put it on until i leave it ain't no way okay back over so I've never, the, I've never I, seen a straight guy talk yeah, to a gay guy so much in my life. Ten in the morning. <laughs> what? Ten in the morning. Why ten in the morning? Um. Uh, uh, like, why ten in the morning? Let's play. Let's play hangman. Hey, so I can, so can guess why ten in the morning. I don't even, I don't know how to play hangman. You gotta guess the word, it's two words. Okay? Two words. Uh-huh. Huh? Uh, two words. Uh, when the... Okay, here we go. When the sun comes up, what is that called? When the sun <laughs> comes up, what is that called? <laughs> Grand Rising, too. Not two words. <laughs> <laughs> you are supposed to be smart. 
Oh, Corey just that's be that's laughing that's and smiling at uh, Zoe, man, them two. Hey, hey that's the end of the video, y'all. That, that's, that's, that's the end. Y'all stay tuned for more content, man. I got more shit in the work. But uh, I'm off to work. Until next time, turn me up. Don't turn me down. Let's get it.